They edited it because they stopped it at a point where the meaning it conveyed to the people listening becomes completely different from the words that Sadiq Khan actually said. That's disgusting lies from Richard Holden. And if he wants to sue me, he can. Richard Holden, you're a disgusting liar. Absolutely disgusting, especially in the week that the mayor has revealed AI, as in fake footage, is being used in an incredibly provocative and potentially dangerous fashion. If you're wondering why I just referred to uh, Rishi Sunak as a coke addict, it's because, he, well, he told us himself. I'm a coke oh, addict, oh, a total coke addict. addict. Uh, and we haven't edited that at all. Using the Richard Holden, chairman of the Conservative Party dictionary, this is proof that Rishi Sunak is a coke addict. I'm a coke oh, addict, oh, a total coke addict. Addict. We haven't we haven't edited it at all. Seriously, Dickie Holden told me that the definition of edit is something different from what I always thought it was as someone who's worked in radio ordering other people to edit stuff for over 20 years. So just for the avoidance of doubt, according to Dickie Holden, chairman of the Conservative Party, here is conclusive unedited proof that Rishi Sunak is a coke addict. I'm a coke addict. Oh, I'm a total coke addict. It's annoying schoolboys in the background trying to join in the conversation of spoilt the Christmas crystal clear quality of my clip there. But what I won't do is use AI to make it sound more convincing. That, uh, yeah, that's probably why Richard Holden and his mates will go next. Uh, and speaking of Tories, past and present, do you remember when Priti Patel came out in favour of terrorism? Well, there is a police investigation, rightly so, taking place right now. Um, and this offender clearly had some history, um, some clear history in relation to counter-terrorism offences. I announced a very clear package of measures, basically all aimed at counter-terrorism and counter-terrorist offenders. We will also be announcing some fundamental changes in addition to what we've already said that we will do to deal with counter-terrorism and counter-terrorist offenders. So... The Tory party yesterday put out a clip of uh, Sadiq Khan misspeaking and immediately correcting himself. The chairman of the Conservative Party this morning, Dick Holden, has said that that is uh, perfectly reasonable and it wasn't edited at all. It was clipped. That long clip was edited and clipped because they mean exactly the same thing in the context of radio. But that was Pretty Patel being too stupid to realise that she'd made a mistake again and again and again and again. What, 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 what is Pretty Patel's problem with counter-terrorism? Why is she opposed to fighting terror why is she in, why is she a pro terror pretty patel is is, is pro terrorist